Hello my dear friends. Hope you are doing wonderful. In today's video we will see how to solve no bootable medium found error in VirtualBox. If you are trying to set up VirtualBox for the first time, this is one of the foremost error that you may encounter. If you are not familiar with VirtualBox, it is a free software that allows you to run a virtual PC within your real PC. You can run any guest operating system on top of any host operating system. For example, you can run Linux within your Windows PC, you can run Mac within your Linux. Even you can run Windows 10 within Windows 7. Let's first see how this error looks like. I have installed VirtualBox and now I'm trying to set up a new virtual machine. Let's try to start the new machine that we have just created. This is the exact error that we are going to fix today. It says, fatal, no bootable medium found. System halted. This means you have created a virtual machine, but not yet installed any guest operating system. Now let's get into the solution part. You need either a real operating system disk, or ISO file of the operating system that you want to run in your guest virtual machine. If you have real OS disk insert the same and restart the virtual machine. This should straight away fix your issue. If not you have to go ahead with ISO approach. I have already downloaded my ISO file, it is present in my download folder. You can download the operating system ISO file from internet. For example if you want to run Ubuntu, download it from official website. Once downloaded, open VirtualBox. Go to Settings. Select Storage. Here I could see my virtual hard disk with the machine name that I have given initially, but it is empty. And, here I have my real optical disk, which is also empty. Both of these are empty in my case and that is exactly the reason why I get this error. If you don't see any optical disk over here, select controller, and tap on this little icon to add optical drive. And select, leave empty. And use this empty disk for further steps. But since I already have an optical disk, let me remove the one that I have just added. Select the optical disk. At the right hand side tap on this disk icon. And choose a disk file, which is nothing but the ISO file that we have already downloaded. Ensure there is only one optical disk and it is mounted with the ISO file. Go to System. Under Boot Order ensure optical disk has been selected, and it is on top of the order. Now try to start the system. Oh yes. We no more get the error, no bootable medium found. You can continue and complete the rest of the OS installation process as you do in your real PC. Once installation process completes, you can unmount or remove the ISO file from optical disk. And change the boot order to start from hard disk. From now on, for all your subsequent boots, your virtual machine will pick the installed guest OS from your virtual hard disk. I hope it was helpful. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Thanks for watching.